When the focus is put on parting fully away from your former ally, many changes come into place in order to feel free. This is what President Ibrahim Traoré is doing, in order to make Burkina Faso fully free from the West, majorly France. Regaining control over a number of things, which the captain together with the citizens publicly declare have been under France's control is the major focus. One of the most crucial things for Burkina Faso is the financial system. On Friday, August 2024, President Ibrahim Trawuri launched Burkina Faso's first state-owned bank. When you hear this, you may become shocked. How does it come to be for a nation to lack its own central bank? Then, you ask yourself, if Burkina Faso has all long been lacking a central bank, which bank has been controlling its national banking system? Again you ask yourself, how is this newly opened public bank is going to carry out banking duties in Burkina Faso? These are the questions which need to be answered. On this earlier mentioned event, President Ibrahim Trawuri launched a newly constructed Treasury Deposits Bank of Burkina Faso. The Central Bank of West African States, call it Banque Centrale de Etats de l'Afrique de l'Ouest, or simply BCAO is a central bank serving the eight West African countries which share the common West African CFA franc currency, comprising the West African Economic and Monetary Union. The treaty establishing the West African Monetary Union, call it Union Monetaire West African, UM, OA, was signed on May 12, 1962 and gave BCAO the exclusive right to issue currency as the common central bank for the, then, seven-member countries that is Ivory Coast, Benin, Burkina Faso, Mali, Mauritania, Niger, and Senegal. As a central bank, or reserve bank perhaps national bank, or monetary authority is an institution that manages the currency and monetary policy of a country or monetary union. This clearly shows how BCE, AO which is controlled by France, is at the center of monitoring and controlling a number of West African countries' financial systems. Now, President Ibrahim Trawuri comes in to stop this way of financial and banking structure. Opening this Treasury Deposit Bank means changing a number of banking structures in Burkina Faso, mainly concerning state or public funds. This newly opened Treasury Bank by the captain has a major duty of providing quality banking services with digital tools that will improve the services of the public treasury, according to the Minister of Economy and Finance. The dare need for this bank is the centralization of the context of the public treasury to establish medium and long-term expenditure and financing forecast and optimize the management of state cash flow. According to the provisions of the law relating to finance laws, all public bodies other than the state are required to deposit all their available funds in the public treasury. This treasury bank serving as a government department related to finance and taxation is now a place or location where treasure, such as currency or precious items, are to be kept. The citizens of Burkina Faso are encouraged to also deposit their cash and also carry out other transactions with this new bank. A batch of bank cards were given to soldiers in order to facilitate their tasks in terms of banking in remote areas where there are no banking services. President Ibrahim Trawuri is improving the gold mining sector, so having this treasury deposit bank is a major step taken, where gold reserves can be kept. Burkina Faso can now uphold substantial quantities of gold within its local reserves. The opening of this treasury deposit bank shows the great journey President Ibrahim Trawuri is taking in order to come up with a further improved Burkina Faso. Indeed, let's now first think about this. For sure this man is wise, and is for sure surrounded by geniuses and pan-Africanists. President Ibrahim Trawuri is making massive transformations in the very sectors of Burkina Faso which need to be corrected. Do you even know that this bank has a greater potential of improving Burkina Faso for good if well-managed? This is what I call a well-informed, pan-Africanist who is informed by pan-African cabinet and immediately executes what is necessary. When we look at this new reform, what does it make us think about? Yes, of course, a new currency and pipeline which is being planned by the three leaders of the Sahel Alliance. 
The possible creation of a common currency among Burkina Faso, Niger, and Mali is one of the major changes the three leaders have on their to-do list toward breaking free from the legacy of colonization. So, seeing President Ibrahim Trawuri opening a treasury deposit bank gives clear signs of realizing that plan. Indeed, this new treasury deposit bank has a greater potential of lifting Burkina Faso's economy with no doubt. What President Ibrahim Trawuri is doing needs no interference, because each step he takes yields positive results, which the citizens of Burkina Faso truly believe is the new breathe of life. Have you ever dreamed of a place you have long been wishing to get to, and someone wakes you up and tells you that he is fully ready to get you there? This is what President Ibrahim Trawuri is doing to Burkina Bays. The aim is to fully part ways with France, which the citizens of Burkina Faso feel it has been at the center of every major thing concerning state in Burkina Faso. With the gold at hand, now a treasury deposit bank, and if the new currency is realized, the future of Burkina Faso is to become brighter. This bank is going to smoothen facilitation, or call it funding of a number of projects in Burkina Faso, a major thing towards the development of a country. President Ibrahim Trawuri is working hard to improve the economic environment of Burkina Faso in order to attract more and legitimate foreign investors into the country. The economic environment of Burkina Faso is, with no doubt, improving due to the number of reforms President Ibrahim Trawuri is putting in place. The economy of the country works better if the state has almost full control over its financial system. As the economic community of West African states, ECOWAS, imposed sanctions on the Sahel Alliance and these countries decided to withdraw from it, they however remain members of the West African Economic and Monetary Union, UMOA, with UMOA having a common currency, the CFA franc, which is issued by the Central Bank of West African states, BCAO. The BCE, AO and the Banque de France are bound by cooperation agreements that include the deposit of a portion of foreign exchange reserves at the Banque de France in France guaranteeing the CFA franc. What have you hard, depositing a portion of foreign reserves to the Bank of France? This is what the Africans are tired of. President Ibrahim Trawuri now wants to have control over the reserves, so with the introduction of this new treasury deposit bank, this control is to be achieved. What do you think about this move by President Ibrahim Trawuri? Don't forget to leave a like for this video and also subscribing to the channel.